The city of Miami Beach declared a state of emergency over the weekend after a deadly start to spring break. Two fatal shootings and some out of control crowds also forced the city to impose overnight curfews. Gabrielle Arzola of our CBS Miami station has more and we want to warn you some of the images are disturbing. Chaos in South Beach this weekend. People ran for cover after gunfire erupted Friday night. Outside, restaurants packed with customers on busy Ocean Drive. One man died in the hospital and another was injured. I don't think I've ever ducked and hid from gunshots in my life. Earlier Sunday morning, a second deadly shooting just blocks away. Surveillance video captured the gunman opening fire on a man walking on the sidewalk. My city doesn't need it. We really don't need to be an all-night party town. Miami Beach Mayor Dan Gelber declared a state of emergency Sunday and instituted a curfew to, quote, control excessively large and unruly crowds. In addition to road closures, the curfew forces restaurants to close by midnight and ban the sale of alcohol off-site after 6 p.m. Residents and hotel guests may be asked to show ID. This is the third year in a row Miami Beach has taken emergency measures to control a surge in visitors, many traveling to Florida from other cities that were facing COVID lockdowns. Last year, 618 people were arrested during spring break. So despite the chaos over the weekend, city commissioners declined to vote or rather extend their state of emergency or their curfew. Instead, they said that liquor stores can no longer sell alcohol after 6 p.m. Nora. Gabrielle Arzola, thank you so much.